what is up youtube welcome back to another vlog i haven't been here in a while and i have my reasons just going through you know a couple things um it is uh, it is currently thursday august 26th i mean august 25th at 7 38 a.m we're leaving here at 10 o'clock um, I'm currently outside the country. Y'all look at the views where I'm at. This, this is on top of our house. This, this is on top of my grandma's house. Um, so, it's my last day. Well, I guess it was my last day. We're leaving today. So ready to go home. Right now, in the U.S., well... In Florida, it is currently 12.39 p.m. It's a seven hour difference. Um, I'm just ready to go. Uh, what else? So yeah, getting to the montage I'm about to record for y'all that I'm about to do because I'm not gonna talk until I get to Tampa. So it's gonna be a little montage from here to the airport, sitting in business class, and the rest of the shit, okay? I'm tired, yeah, I only got like four hours of sleep, maybe three. So yeah, I'll get into the montage, but the montage is gonna give regardless, period. I'm outside in a damn Jeep, right outside, TT. Two turn, baby girl, you know me. Still with the dolls that I What is up, you guys? I am back. It is, it's been a couple days since I got back. It's currently Tuesday, August 30th. I came back last week on Friday, and it's just been a couple rough days, so that's why I've been like, um, that's why it's been like a little rough for me. But, so let me see if I can zoom it out a little bit. No, that's in. Oh, I guess that's all I can. Okay, whatever. So I just got home. Um, I have a lot for you guys today, but somewhat a lot. So um, a couple weeks ago, I basically bought some new, I'm gonna turn this down, cause who keeps on 76? 70, no, I can't do 74, that's fine. 
So I ended up buying, sorry I can't see me right now, let me go to my room. So, I'm trying to redo my room just for a switch of change. Um, currently right now, hold on, let me turn the fan off. So this is like the setup, um, don't worry about the mess because, well it's not even a mess, it's just three pairs of clothes that need to be washed. Um, so this is like my, y'all know, know my setup, is this, um, this pattern or whatever, but I bought some new, I bought some new comforter, I bought a new comforter set, and this is how it looks, so this is the vibe I'm going for, this right here, let me see if I can, y'all can see it. So it's like a cream-ish gray. I wouldn't say cream. I'll say white and gray. Um, kind of. I I seen a little bit of. Um, I thought I saw brown in it, but it's really white and gray cream. Oh, like right here. It's like a creamy right here, a creamy reflection right there. So, um, I'm gonna put that on my bed, and then I went to Target, and when I went inside, I seen that they had twenty. Why so close? Oh my god, wrong way. So one of the target and got some things. I got like two new two like little two more pillows. And I got this comforter set to match. So it's white, brown. Well well, it's not really brown, it's like gray cream. It's like a dark gray and black to match it. And then I'm just gonna change the vibe up a little bit. So I'm about to make it a little quick and change to an outfit and then redo my room. I might eat first because I'm hungry, so just wait on that. And then I will get back to you guys whenever I get settled in. Peace. Oh, I forgot to show y'all. Oh my god, the lighting is so good and my skin looks real good. So I went to, um, I went to, hold on, let me sit you guys down. Now I wish I could sit you guys down like this. Okay, but anyways, yeah, it's not gonna work, is it? All right, so I went to Nordstrom today after work and I got a couple goodies. So I went in there because I ran out of, I ran out of the Noshinku hand sanitizer. Last time they didn't have any, and they only had one. Try me one, and I took it because I, I need to hand sanitizer. So I got I got two of these. They were on sale for seven dollars. So I bought two of them to carry around. I'm about to post this on my Instagram and tell them, tell the girls I just put them on. Um, I was I actually talking to the um Byredo, um sales rep. And she gave me three samples because I was really looking at the gypsy water because the girls are using gypsy water right now. Uh, the girls are using gypsy water right now. So she gave me three samples. Why? Okay, it's just it's just focus now. So she gave me three samples. She gave me the gypsy water, the Blanque, and the De Los Santos. Um, I think my favorite was the... I think my favorite was the Gypsy Water, and then the, hold on, let me see. Oh, hold on, wait. I think it's this one. Hold on. Yeah, so my favorite out of the three, obviously the Gypsy Water's first, um, but if I have to put them in like one, two, three, I would go for a gypsy water first and then the Blanche one and then the um, the De Los Santos. So the De Los Santos is more of a musky, I wanna say musky, it would be like a, it's a harsh scent. So I would have to mix that something with something soft and then the other two are more of a lighter scent so I would mix that with something a little more harsh. Um, just so the scent can like, yeah. Um, he also gave me another sample of these three skin cares um, Because I was in there looking for new moisturizers and new like something new because I want to try something new So this is he gave me samples of this 
uh, which I think will last a little bit long because these are actually big samples. Um, so these are called, if I'm not mistaken, Kales. Kales. So it's this brand right here. Um, this is what he gave me. So this is the Ultra Facial Cleanser, um, gentle liquid formula that cleanses without over drying or stripping skin. It says for all skin types. So basically a cleanser. This is the Ultra Face Cream, 24 hour daily lightweight hydrating formula for healthy looking skin with galore, no, with glacial glycoprotein. Whatever that means. So it's basically a moisturizer, I'm saying. And then this is eye zone treatment. So this is for super multi um, corrective um, brow bone, eyelid, can you read? Outer corner, under eye. So I'm guessing this is like an under eye, a eye um, color correction. And then he also gave me this. Um, can you see? It's so small. Uh, these dermatologist solutions, um, it's retinol skin renewing daily microdose serum. So I'm guessing like a vitamin A serum type of thing. Um, but it's for skin renewing, so it's microdose serum, which is with a precise daily strength of concentration of pure retinol. I heard retinol was good for your face. So I'm going to try this for a couple of days. I mean, he did give me a sample. And if he, if I do like it, I will go back. But my favorite thing of today's was getting me some of the um, Byredos, because I really like, the, I really like the scents. I don't know which one to pick because they're all like three hundred dollars each for the regular bottle. But they do have the um, the Gypsy Water and Body Wash, and it's fifty dollars. So I might go ahead and try it one time if I like it. Hey, I might have to buy it. Because, oh, the it smells so good in the scent. So I'm gonna really try the gypsy water with the ebony woods from Zara. Um, hopefully that works out because I really like the gypsy water. If not, the De Los Santos would definitely be a good mystery, um, with ebony woods. So that's what I have for today. And then let me show you guys the which one is okay. So this was the um. This is the hand sanitizer right here. No shinku, it's black, it's sleek, good for a um, side bag. Has a good scent to it. It reminds me of something. Reminds me of something with Le Labo on it. Um, my next big purchase, I really want to get something Le Labo. Uh, maybe Santel 33. Um so yeah, this is what I got for today. The, and I, if I didn't tell you, these were all actually on sale at Nordstrom for seven dollars. So that's that. It's in the bergamot scent, and it's black. So black is my aesthetic. So I will give you guys. Oh, and I gave a lady. I got a lady's number. Her name is Bailey. She works at Nordstrom. So if you're ever in Tampa, Florida, and you want to go to Nordstrom in International Mall, her name is Bailey, and she is a great sales associates um, I literally only spent $15 on there so that's that I can throw this away because I know I'm not going to be returning anything um, I'm glad for my goodies thank you for my thank you Bailey for assisting me and giving me my goodies and thank you for the other gentleman for giving me a um, sample of all the goodies for my face so that's an update on me. Um, like I said, I'm gonna get something to eat here. I'm gonna make me something, and I'll get back to you guys whenever I said it. And I'm definitely gonna do hookah tonight. Oh, I forgot to tell y'all again. Hold on. So, ooh, this is all right. Hold on, let me open this up. Um, put your right here. Put your right here. So I got some new cups. Um, I will. So I'm currently making a Amazon storefront. So you guys can purchase um, the nice things that I get off of Amazon. Uh, this was one of them. This is a cup. Oh my God, it's so sleek and it's so me. Black is my aesthetic. The nice bamboo lid was giving. And it came with a straw. 
It was only twenty dollars, so it wasn't expensive. I didn't know so they had the lines where it tells you the time of drinking water. So that's good for you know motivation. And it also comes with a top. Oh, right here. So it has this bamboo lid and the straw, and it also comes with a top like this. So you can screw it on and take it to the gym or something. Um, that's one. And then the other thing that I bought was these um, cups. I've been wanting to get these cups for so long. Um, it is these. Hold on, this one. Ha this one has water in it. Um, so it's a nice glass cup. It's just like one of these. I had this. I had these already. Oh my god, why does it look so dirty? I have to wash these again. Well, this one because I've been using one in months. So I'm gonna have to wash that glass again. But it's just like that. It has a little bit. It's basically like a beer glass. Um, it comes with a bamboo lid and it comes with eight straws. And there were only eight for twenty-eight dollars, so you can't beat it. Um, so I'm gonna have that linked in my Amazon storefront whenever I have that posted. Um, but I really fell in love with this cup because I really, really like use it for like everything. So that is that. Um, but yeah, so now I'm gonna get something to eat. Well, I'm gonna make me something because I'm hungry and starving. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna eat because like my fridge is not really giving even though we just went shopping yesterday and spent like $400. But I don't know, I don't know what I wanna eat. So I'll figure it out, but once I get back to doing stuff in my bedroom, I will get back to you guys. And yeah, stay tuned. about it yet I feel like I have to give it a couple more days to see how I feel about it because if I don't like it I'm gonna return it but like I like the colors but I feel like I have to add a couple like colors to my room to bring out the bed so I'm thinking about like bringing out a couple colors like maybe like beige or like not not really beige like a tan with the black because all black and then this doesn't really match so i have to do like a little bit of lighter colors so i'm thinking like tan vibes because i already have the black i already have the gray and the white see like this i don't know if this is like a cream or just like a light gray but I feel like if I bring out a, a, like a nude vibe, then the bed will like come together. So that's how I feel about it right now. I like the bed set in general. 
But I just need, I think I just need a little bit more. And like these pillows have to go. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get new pillows, but I'm gonna just leave these for now just to have something on my bed. So it's giving home slash bed shopping soon. I mean room shopping soon at Home Goods because I need a little bit more to this room. Like I like the comforter set and I actually do like um this set as well. But you see how this has like a little bit of brown in it? Not even brown. I don't want to say brown. It has like a little gray in it. So I have to bring out the lighter tones in my room. Um, but overall, I do like it. Uh, it's not a bad like bed set. I just feel like um, I have to bring out more tones to this room to make it look better. So it's giving nice bases. This lip has to go. That lip has to go. It's old fashioned. My mom put it there because she had nowhere else to put the lamps. So I was like, okay, I'll just take them. But yeah, they have to go. Um, this may stay. I don't know yet how I'm feeling. That's a candle. Those plants have to go. Everything over here has to go. Literally, I need a make a. I need a, I need a room makeover. I'm thinking like get like a glass plate. Put something not like a regular glass plate, but like um, like a like an octagon with the glass inside of it, and then put stuff on it with plates and stuff. I don't know. I have to think about it. I know I want to do some nice vases and put them over here with some fox fur. Um, out of them. That's cute. So yeah, we're just gonna go shopping in a couple days. Whenever I am free, maybe Saturday I can go to Home Goods or back. Not no Target. Oh, Amazon. Amazon it is. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna keep my old bed set just in case I really don't like this bed set and it doesn't match with anything, which is hardly because I like I really like it. It's a vibe. So. I'll keep you guys posted. Oh, I'm so tired. I didn't even eat yet. I went straight to doing my room. So, yeah. I don't even know what time is it. Where is my phone? I don't even know. My phone's probably in the kitchen. So, I'm going to have to clean all of this mess up. Um, This is going to get packed up. I'll come back to this in a few. Let me eat and get settled in. I don't know if I want matcha or coffee. I'm going towards coffee, but I don't know. But I don't even see if anybody called my phone. You know me, I think I'm important. And yeah, I got two FaceTime calls. That was the ghettoist. Hold on, let me put you guys down a little bit. That was the ghettoist coffee maker I have ever made. I, that was so ghetto. But let's make a taste test. The glass speaks for itself, no shade. I need a little bit more. Let me add a drizzle of, so I usually get the blonde or the dark roast in the Starbucks. So let me just add a drop, more coffee. I think I'm gonna be up a little bit late today because I'm gonna be smoking hookah. And let me add The only thing I don't like about it, these coffee creamer like cups, like whenever I open it up, it just spits everywhere. I'm just add a little more of that. Doesn't have to be foamy. I'm gonna mix that up. 
But I, I don't know about y'all, but I like my coffee light. So light means more milky, creamer. I don't like mine on the darker side. I just love these cups. Let's give it a try now. There we go. So let's try and take a I'll try and take a thumbnail for part of my um no. can't take a thumbnail. Oh my god, it's ugly. Hold on, wait, let me get myself together. Get the light. Yeah. That gives. Now just imagine just imagine this cup with matcha. Ugh, a vibe. I still don't know what I'm gonna eat. So far, this coffee's been my dinner. Oh, another thing. So, I went to Target. Cause I don't know about y'all, but I love the fall season and fall is literally my favorite season with Christmas. So like the fall and Christmas is my fave because for one, pumpkin is my fave. It scents, flavor and coffee, like, oh, this smells so good. This is pumpkin spice cupcake. I got it from Target and it just makes my house smell so good. And then the creamer I just used was pumpkin, um, The creamer I just used was the non-dairy creamer, almond and oat milk, inspired by pumpkin spice latte. Hold on, you guys can't see. You can go to your nearest Publix, Trader Joe's, um, anywhere to get pumpkin creamer. That's one of my faves. Um, I don't know about y'all, but I love it. And yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna eat. Uh, what did I eat today? Today is, oh, oh. Ugh, no, I don't. So I really didn't eat today, and I don't, I don't think I'm gonna eat a lot. So I have a couple things I have to do. For one, um, I still haven't unpacked my clothes from my suitcase, so I'm gonna wash all the clothes and then pack it, and then, I mean, put it up. Um, but I think I'm gonna make a sandwich. I don't know what about y'all, but artisano, Artisanal bread is my favorite. It's so soft. I usually get the wheat one, but the white one is pretty good. Um, so yeah, it might be a, a turkey sandwich kind of night. Because, I don't know what I'm gonna eat. And I don't know about y'all, but I love putting turkey pepperoni on my sandwiches. Ooh, it's key. So we're gonna do my mayo on here. I love, like, I love mayo. But I can I can only get mayo in the squeeze bottle. I don't like the other mayo. So it's like, it's different to me. Top. If I wanna be cute, I'll cut it in slices like this. Like, not straight, but diagonal. Not, not, huh. Is it diagonal? I don't know. But not like this, I cut it like triangles. Cause it's cuter that way, but. I'm trying to be cute tonight. Here, I'm hungry. Cheers. What's up guys, I'm back. I'm currently watching Kyra. She just posted a video like seven minutes ago. And I'm glad she came up because I love me some Kyra. So 
So that's it for the night. I'm just gonna chill and maybe smoke a hookah. I don't know yet. And just watch Kyra. Um, I'm gonna actually make me some more iced coffee because it was actually good. So I'm gonna do that right now and then um, gonna probably get a hookah out right now. Um, and yeah, so I'll catch y'all another day. Peace out.